study by UCLA researchers finds that birth control, hormonal birth control that's take, t taken orally can actually change the structure of a woman's brain. Now, as you know, there are some side effects to taking oral contraceptives, but this latest study shows that there are changes that are made in the brain, but they're unsure as to whether or not these are temporary changes or permanent changes. So now let me tell you what they found. In a study conducted on 90 women, neuroscientists at UCLA found that two key brain regions, the lateral orbitofrontal cortex and the posterior cingulate cortex, uh, were thinner in women who had used oral contraception than in women who did not. Now, the lateral orbital frontal cortex plays an important role in emotion regulation and responding to rewards, while the posterior cingulate cortex is involved with inward directed thought and shows increased activity when we recall personal memories and plan for the future. All right, so there's the very complicated way of saying that it impacts the part of your brain that helps you deal with emotions, okay? Yeah. So it makes a lot of sense because for oh, some women, yeah, for some women, when they first start taking birth control, it can have some serious impact on your mood. And you have these mood swings, some women can have suicidal thoughts, some women can just go from being extremely happy to being extremely sad. And so at first it was assumed that, okay, well you're putting synthetic hormones into your body and your body's just trying to get used to it so those mood swings are normal and they'll normalize as you continue usage. But it's actually having an impact on certain regions of your brain. They're thinner. So this could be a serious uh, complication. There have been conflicting studies. So back in 2010, there was a study indicating that birth control can actually have an opposite effect, right? But in this latest study, they found that the portions of your brain that get affected could lead to increased anxiety and de depressive symptoms that some women experience when they start taking the pill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's really troubling. They, they're not sure whether the effects are permanent or just when you're on the pill. But if it's actually changing the physiology of your brain, then uh, that would lean towards permanent. Yeah. And, and so. Uh, that really scares the heck out of me. It scares me too, but understand, look, this isn't a story that we're doing for fear-mongering. The pill is extremely important for many women. Um, but the reason why these stories are important, in my opinion, is because sometimes you'll have legislation being proposed that would offer birth control without a prescription. And I think that that's a terrible idea. No, I think it's shame. very important to go to a doctor and consult with them before you start taking oral contraceptives because it does have an impact on your body, it does have an impact on your mood, and it's not just some benign thing. It's something that could really impact you in the worst possible way. So, so keep that in mind. If, yeah. you're, if you get the wrong birth control, that's what I meant. Yeah, and so, uh, look, I been an enormous fan of birth control pills, of course. I think it changed uh, society, I think, for the better. It liberated people in a lot of ways. That's part of the reason why some conservatives still hate it to this day. They didn't want people liberated. So there's an enormous upside in, in, in the pill. But, you know, logically speaking, after I read the story, I thought, well, anytime you're taking something for a long period of time that is not natural to your body and, and it's playing with your hormones, of course it could have consequences. Yeah, well, it could have right. consequences. We it could, it could not. I mean, right. th 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 this is a limited study, and what's clear is that this should be, we should be spending a lot of money to study this more. Yep. But, you know, we do stuff all the time that affects our natural brain chemistry, and most of, much of it is incredibly helpful. I mean, you guys are for the legalization of weed. That affects your brain chemistry. Lots yeah, of Yeah, but that's kind of, that's pretty cool, though, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> and now, um, by the way, the birth control pill is also enormously cool, right, right. Mm -hmm. in... in, in uh, in its effects, uh, as we described here, uh, but but you got to be careful and but just let it let's let it play out. In yeah. fact, they say here we need to do more studies to find out what behaviors might be changed. But the study gives us some targets to start with, and I think the first place to look is at the effect of birth control pills on regulating emotions. So it's just the beginning. Don't panic yet, um, but uh, but it is interesting note.